everybody and this is for you Mary you requested to see my guava seedlings and this is it I'm currently conducting an experiment with um, my seedlings this guava this particular guava here is I put indoors with the rest of my orchids and I'm gonna make sure um, I'm gonna um, keep them alive inside and this other one here I will keep in here uh, in a cold colder climate with my with my tropicals my citrus sis and we'll see which one is gonna grow um, thicker in the canes or um, it's gonna we'll see if which one's really gonna thrive if this one it's gonna stay here in the colder area and it would become hardy I may keep this because I do love the guava fruit it's my childhood favorite fruit we grow I grew up with guavas side by side kinda because like they grow in the Philippines like weeds so I'm gonna experiment with this four plants here seedling of course when they out outgrow the pot I will transfer them the bigger pot to get some fruits maybe I don't know how long they're gonna give me any fruits but this one is going indoors yes and this one I'm gonna let this stay in here too because I don't need so many um, seedlings and I have a few in here few seedlings uh, oh yeah I planted this one from seeds I bought the fruit in the Asian market and I don't know what kind of guava is um, I'm the one I'm I got I don't know the variety name for those but it was delicious and it was a yellowish inside or white white when it's just crunchy and it turns yellow when you let it ripen in the table yeah but it's delicious so and I'm gonna experiment with this which one it's gonna thrive if the one from the um, warmer climates or this one in the colder climate I mean it's protected from the snow it just it stays here in the unheated room but it's away from the snow we'll see because my other tropicals here they are acclimated in this acclimated already in this environment because we had a bad winter last year and they survive they grow yeah Side, this one, these lemons are maturing, and there's more fruits in the back right there. So hard to see, they're prickly. There's more, like that. It's more. I don't want to disturb them. I don't want to get pricked by the thorns today. Yes. And in a way. This is the guava Mary and I'm hoping this will inspire you to get more um to buy guava in the Asian market and plant some more in the sea. I'll uh, plant some seeds in the pots. This would be nice if just grown in the um, big um what's a greenhouse. But we'll see if I can grow this indoors and actually give me some fruits. Because I do love the guavas. My childhood favorite fruits. Okay guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.